we are fortunate enough to have a dream team where we have amazing teachers. Hello, Tiffany. We have amazing mentors. Hello, Mark. And we have amazing in-school coordinators. Hello, Mr. Strickland. And we also have community partners and corporate partners that rally alongside us every day to make it happen for our young people in spite, in spite of everything that's going on. Jonas, um, I was not expecting the kind of help that I was getting from you this year, and I'm so grateful for it. Um, if it wasn't for you, we definitely wouldn't have had a program this year. You're someone who just showed up because you're clearly there for the benefit of the kids. You're there because you want to help them. Uh, speaking of relationships, you're, you're someone who just kind of pulls everybody in, makes sure everybody's there. And I'm, I'm truly appreciative of that. So thank you so much, Jonas, for being part of this team. And thank you so much for all your help this year. Thank you, Mr. Strickland. Thank you, Jonas. Appreciate you so much, sir. So we are here to celebrate you and honor you today. Are you surprised? Yes. Yay. Yes. <laughs> so you were... You were going to hear, I, I couldn't wait for this moment. I was like bursting at the seams for the last couple of weeks, but. Um, but I don't know if everyone on the call knows this, but Miss Green's classroom isn't just like for her build students. Every student who is an idea will come in and say hi like no matter what no matter the time of day no matter what's happening her classroom's a magnet and her her presence as a teacher is a magnet to students at, at idea and she's just caring and friendly and actually a friend to them which i think a lot that is like missing in a lot of classrooms right now we can't thank you enough for everything you do as a teacher navigating over 70 build students. Um, it's, it's really wild. So thank you so much, Ms. Green. Thank you. It is important to me that our students are able to sit where they are in these classrooms and look up and see your face, to see someone in particular who looks like them, who's young, who's vibrant, who's ambitious, who's goal-oriented, who's hardworking, who's pouring into them genuinely. And I listen to you sometimes when you're giving this feedback to our students and it's coming from such a genuine place. I mean, you are truly pouring into them, not only as academics, but as well-rounded whole beings. And Raina and I are fortunate enough to be able to see that all the time. And all of us here at Build Metro DC are truly so very, very honored uh, for you to be a member of our dream team. So thank you, sir, for your service and your faithfulness in spite of everything that's happened this year. Thank you, Mark Orby. Dream team. Thank you, sir. Now I just want to say thank you so much, Offrey. Uh, it's been a it's been a lot and I thank you for your patience and trying to navigate with our student schedules and them having to get on Metro and having to log in on the Metro and, and not really, be, so I truly appreciate your flexibility and your patience and your understanding. Um, this program would not be what it was without your, your leadership and your commitment. I wanna thank you, Ms. Crystal, for just working with our students over the summer, loving on our students like, you know, sometimes, you know, during the summer times, you know, students can, you know, fall in and out, but they were engaged with the program because you really cared about their well-being. I mean, coming up to the school, interviewing them, making sure that they are excelling in their classes. I mean, it really, you went above and beyond just to show them that you love them. And that really stood out to me. And, you know, shout out to Carlton for just taking the time to engage with me and laying out platforms for our school and how build and our school can partner. Um, you have been, I was, this has been an outstanding partnership and I want to thank the entire build team, uh, Raina, um, everybody who I've worked with throughout my time with you all, 
this could not be done without the work that you all are doing. So again, thank you so much for supporting our school. We truly appreciate it. Um, yes, uh, thank you all for that. This was definitely unexpected. <laughs> um, yeah, like, uh, I'm not just, I feel like I just do what you're supposed to do. I mean, I don't feel like I'm doing anything extra ordinary, but maybe I am. Um, yeah, we have had a lot of changes up into like our CTE director is now no longer with us as of Thursday. So yeah, um, I thank y'all for being patient and flexible because I know that we always have a something going on over here um, and y'all are very flexible about everything. So thank y'all. You are very welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Green. Oh, man, uh, it's a blessing. <laughs> it's a blessing. I, I think that throughout this program, I've I've seen the amount of coordination that goes into what you guys have set for the students, and anything I can add on to it is 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 what I'll do. And I mean, that's <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm 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 truly blessed. I think it's a great opportunity. I, I've never myself had the opportunity to have somewhat of a mentorship program uh, when I was like in middle school, high school. Um, and I've gotten the opportunity to be a part of a good amount of programs throughout college. And I see the amount of impact that I can have just by just bridging, bridging a connection between what you think you can do and what can actually be done. So I'm, I'm just happy that I get the opportunity to do that. So I'm, I'm thankful and I'll keep on, keep on giving as much genuine, authentic advice as I can because it's, it just takes a thought to, to make action towards something that you really want to achieve. So that's what, that's, that's all I got. <laughs> that's all I got.